Hey what's up guys, Mortimer here, welcome to a different video from usual, it's going to be a commentary over my gameplay from earlier on Black Ops 4, Nuketown, absolutely killing this game, but um, we're going to be talking about my first time going paintballing, you know, I really wanted to make a video talking about uh, me going paintballing for the first time, so I was uh, joined by my good friends, you know, Anthony, uh, Sean, and uh, John, uh, aka Blind Prophet, uh, Big Easy, and I actually don't know if John has a YouTube channel or not, I will find that out and link it in the description if he has it, but yeah, so... You know, a little, little, not going into personal details, but a little drama over the weekend happened and I really wanted a way to vent or have fun or just basically get my mind off, get my mind off of things. And Sean and John had coupons for paintballing and I was like, I'm down, you know, had barely enough money to go there, blew all my money on rentals and stuff. But we're gonna get into that later. So we get into the cars, we're packing everything and I'm just seeing Big Easy just pack so much stuff. You know, he's got his custom paintball gun, his sight, just everything. Uh, now that I know my turns, more of my terms now, his gas, his hopper and stuff. And well, he didn't have a hopper because um his paintball gun is mag fed. See, I want a hopper. I don't want a mag fed gun. At first I did because you know, it was realistic, but I guess uh, watching professionals and people that are really good at it prefer hoppers because you can actually just shoot more. And um, John was having problems in the middle of the, of the paintball games. Uh, with his reloading so I really want a, a hopper base gun so fast forwarding we get to the paintball place you know we paid we ran I watched the safety video we ran out our stuff uh, really big thanks to Big Easy uh, lending me his uh, elbow pads I actually didn't realize this until after watching some tips and tricks uh, about clothing and stuff I was probably wearing the worst uh, clothing possible. I was wearing bright blue jeans, red, bright red Jordans, freaking a gray gray shirt, and elbow pads and a helmet and stuff. The rental stuff. So I was a pretty, pretty easy target. So and overall, the game was extremely fun. I guess the game that I really would want to talk about to the best of my memory are the two games that I remember to the best of my memory. The, uh, our second game, uh, it was in these mazes, I guess. It wasn't these mazes, but in the middle map, there was kind of these uh, mazes that have a lot of turns in there. And that's when I actually got my first kill. My first kill was uh, pretty close quarters. It felt great. Man, but those paintballs hurt. Those paintballs hurt. In my third game, I got wailed in the side of the head. I didn't realize how bad I was hurting until the next day when I was washing my hair, putting gel, and when I was massaging my head to put my gel in my hair, I just felt this giant bump on the side of my head. <laughs> I was like, man, I got wailed. But yeah, I'm. And then the same thing happened. And oh, in the second game, you know, part two of the second game, one of my teammates at the end of the tunnel, I was with him, ran out of paintball, right? And so he said, hey, I don't have any paintball, but I will look around and tell you who to fire at. And long story short, I, I got two friendly fire kills. My aim was super on point. He's like, I hear someone in total. And I would just, I would just give the quickest peek of my life. And, and I got two friendly fires. It was horrible. And I can't even say karma because before that even happened in my first game, after I got my first kill, I was running the flank around. I slid, I crouched and I got shot like five times in my butt, on my butt, on the side of my butt. And then I looked and then when I ran, you know, had my hand up walked what as i was walking back the people that shot at me they were my teammates you're saying oh my bad bro so even before i got the two friendly fire gears i got friendly fired myself which is absolutely hilarious and fast forwarding actually during those games i felt so out of shape like uh me being an athlete with football and stuff uh, i've been mostly focusing on strength and not cardio and like even the first game just sprinting for like the first five seconds it was horrible i was out of breath i couldn't think I don't think I had a, a very good uh, decision making skills because of how much I was like focusing on like oh my gosh I am about to pass out but yeah I, I, I've been motivated to uh, that that's basically built my motivation to get my cardio back up is so the next time we go paintballing I'm not huffing and puffing our last game was a scenario game we did capture the flag and that that game was horrible you know it was super passive the other team was extremely aggressive they were team pushing while the four of us, Prophet, uh, Big Easy, and John, we were all just trying to push up, cover each other, and things weren't going our way. But overall, like, as a thing with friends, I give paintball a 10 out of 10, like, being with friends, like, me already made my list of the gun that I want, the hopper, the gas, the gas tank that I want, the helmet, the gloves, elbow pads, pants, legs, even the knockoff GoPro. I got everything on my list. 
I'm actually looking for jobs and stuff and ways to make money so I can, you know, get better gear. I don't want to wear rentals. I want to have my own gear. I want to carry my own stuff. I want to have my stuff to be customizable and fit me. And with the GoPro, you already know that it means I'm going to have a lot of content coming. Hopefully, I can get to the point where all four of us are making content and all four of us are like have our POVs. I would love to have four different POVs in my paintball video, which would be awesome. Like not even like switching off, just all four of us like on one screen, like a four split screen, which would be awesome you know that was just honestly just the highlights of the day just paintballing for the very first time i definitely recommend it it's super fun you know the paintballs don't hurt they kind of sting well unless you get hit in the side of the head but they're not like to the point where you cry like i got shot so many times and it was just a little sting i don't know it's because i played football or it's because i've been uh, adding on more muscle but they didn't hurt it just stung and then like wherever you got hit if it's kind of close or if you got hit that it wasn't far range it'll sting the next day but then the day after that you'll, you'll be perfectly fine so like if you did this like once a week you know it'd be fine you lift but we're planning to do this once a month for sure i'm going to be geared out the next month you know it's only my second time and i'm already trying to gear out because you know the first time we did rentals i want to see okay is this something that i want to invest to and after we did it's like okay i do want to invest into this so we're going to invest in this well big easy and john they're already invested into it so that's down to anthony i mean profit and not he's getting he already has a job that he's gonna uh do and then after his probation is over he's gonna buy his stuff you know, and then I'm gonna buy my stuff after I get my job. So I'm super excited. Uh, shout out for uh, to Big Easy and John for taking us uh, paintballing. Can't wait to go again. I can't wait to make content for you. That's what I'm honestly most looking forward to. Like I make game stuff, but like, like just to have uh, paintballing videos and uh, Collector Sin gave me a really good idea to have the camera on the right side of me so it looks like a first person shooter for you guys but yeah i can't wait to do that you know i don't know if my commentary videos like this should be longer or shorter but definitely let me guys what you know uh in the comment section tell me you guys about your uh, paintball experience tell me what your what your gear is what you're running do you make videos if you do make videos feel free to link your channel in the description i mean in the comment section if you make paintball stuff i really like watching paintball videos especially the ones with the gopro camera so Thank you guys so much for watching this commentary video. Black Ops 4. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you guys in the next video. Bye bye.